Yes, viewers and subscribers, me again with another hit, with another boom. You see, one of the things we need to get out of the system, you see, we as Jamaican people, we have something in a way where we need to get out of the system, you know. We need to get certain things out of the system. I don't know if I just missed you, so, or I don't know what it is. But, you know, say, from time to time, you hear people, I said this thing, you know. When you see a youth come from out of a poor community or poor family and certain things, and you see them reach success and fame, and then you start, see them start doing some, something. Yeah, I wonder, say, all oh, them people, I do them things, they're them weird. But I know enough people saying is, oh, Lord, you, them man, because them have come from nothing to something. I hear when people say that something, they say, from nothing to something. As far as we me know, everybody I come from nothing. Because more ask somebody if you tell me one of the last time, then see somebody were born in a clothes. Or born in a pampas. Or born in a nappy. As far as I know, everybody upon the face of the earth born naked. So they, everybody come here with nothing. You understand? So when a youth go get lucky or whatever, in a life, and then they start doing some things, and people are saying, No, man, because the man, the man, the man, the man come from nothing, nothing, no go so. If, if that was the case, then if the people, them will come from nothing and say them reach to something, and then can make a kind of big party because they come from nothing with a heap of champagne and a heap of this and a heap of that. People in Taika, if you do what they want to still, don't get me wrong and don't get it twisted. If them can do that because they come from nothing, you can just imagine the people that are born in something. I tell you, people are born from a rich family. The people that are born can see luxury. The people that are born can see money, can see everything. <laughs> if the people who are born can see nothing, they can't do that. But you expect people who are born can see it for you. They can do ten times what they do. But guess what? They don't do it. I serve people who say a mindset and culture thing. Mindset and culture thing. Every time you see that something, they say, be from nothing to something. From your barn, you are something, you know. From your barn, you are somebody. From your barn, you are somebody and you are something. So whatever you see a manifest in your life somewhere down the line, it was already ordained if it happened to you. It was already in your, in your blood line, in your system, in your nature if it happened to you. But Uncle Chu said it never manifests itself as yet. So because you come from a poor family or a poor background and you make some money now, there are things where you have to do. You have to go all the way out. That's why a lot of people come from nothing, as can to them, to something, and then, then go back to nothing. You understand? Because them have a saying, say, if you don't remember where you come from, you don't know which part you go. You understand? And a lot of people, me see, tend to live that kind of way. Yes, enough people, me see, live that kind of way. And that is a part of our culture we need to cut out, man. We need to cut that out. This from nothing to something. What kind of idiot thing that? From nothing to something. We can't, we just can't come to it, you know. We just can't come to it. Everybody have a past. Everybody have a background. Yeah? Everybody have a foundation where they might come from. But it doesn't mean, say, because you have come from a certain place and you reach a certain place, you have to do certain things. You understand? What it means is you're coming from nothing or you never did have nothing in the past. Yeah? And God bless you. That you come. You come have something. God will give you something to build upon so that your children and your grandchildren and whoever come <coughs> after you now, after you come go through the struggles them where you did go through as as a youth, a grow up, yeah? It's a change of course. They get a help in your life to change the course and the direction of how your life was and how you don't want to see your kids and grandkids them come turn out to be in a life. So are you what God give you and the best thing you get and if you have to take you and waste it and dash you away. If you have to invest it properly and build upon it. So, I invest it good so that your pity them or whoever come after you can come see something where they can build upon as well too and take it to another level. 
that's what it means. It doesn't mean say you never did have nothing and you can't have something. I know that you have something, you have to waste it and show people say boy, boy, you know one time he did poor, you know, but you see me get rich, you know, you know, because things are going on, you know, so me can do all kinds of something, you know, because I get rich, you know, you know. No, I know so it, man. I know so it, go, man. I know so it, go. And I've seen that thing so many times. I, I mean, I say, why people tend to do these things, man? Why some people? But you see, and everybody, certain people do certain things, you know, as far as I can see, you know. Certain people will do certain things. And everybody are going to get up and say certain things and do certain things. Because some people are more clever. Some people are more educated. Some people are more understanding. Some people know what life is all about. So some people just will never, ever do certain things. I mean, you know, this nothing to something business from nothing to something. Me say, everybody come here born with nothing. Everybody born come here naked. Me never see nobody were born in a pampas nor a nappy nor a clothes yet. Everybody, no matter... Whether you come from a poor family or a rich family or a high society family or whatever family or whatever community or whatever village or whatever town you come from, whatever parish you come from, everybody born come here same way. Everybody born come here with nothing. You understand me, I said, though? And if somehow we're not careful, we're going to born come here with nothing. And if we're going to go back with what we come from with nothing, same way. But you see, some people. Some people are so selfish, them think of themselves. That's why them do certain things. Them think of themselves. That's why them do certain things. If they may think about them future and think about them bloodline and think about who will come after them, them wanna do certain things. Cause if, if you're talking about for nothing, nothing to something, you're the first thing you tell yourself, boy, when me and you me also go through hell, you know, and suffering, you know, and God help me you know where we can Take one and one and make two, you know. So, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to build upon this, you know, because I don't want to know my youth, I don't know my youth, them youth, I don't know my youth, them youth, them youth, and great grand youth, and none of them come, if you come, go through, when they go through, I go through it as an experience for them. Me experience it for them, yeah. And me are the burden bearer for them. So, I you have to bring them and make them know, say, you see what I go on, so nobody can waste it, nobody can destroy it. A bill enough a bill upon it. You understand? And you have to grow your youth them in a certain way. If you know, say, whatever they can see, them build upon it, and then grow for them youth. And that's why I see the Asian family, them, and certain family, them, we always have something. Because then, you see, let me tell you something. You see, in a life, you see, when you start check and check, say, so you have something, you eventually end up not have nothing. Because when you start check what you have, you, and you start saying, boy, me have this, me have that. In the back of your mind, you feel like you reach somewhere. That's what you feel. But ultimately, you don't reach nowhere yet. Because if you check what you have, compared to what other people have, you realize that you don't have nothing. You don't even start have nothing yet. So when you start check what you have, you end up not have nothing. No matter what you have, you have to tell yourself, say, boy, we give God thanks to what we say, but at the end of the day, if there's more to be added, I hit me a go for. You understand? Don't put no limit on yourself in a life. Don't put no limit on yourself in a life. And a lot, a lot of people do that. They limit themselves. They reach to one little point and they say, Yeah, me all right now. I'm rich and everything and I'm a nice. You take a stock. You don't have nothing yet. You don't even start if you have nothing yet when you check your life and check other people's life. Yeah? But this idea about nothing to something, me not believe in it. Me don't know who else believe in it. But to me, it's a very ignorant way of talking about from nothing to something. Anyway, as me say, my people, for those who have not yet subscribed, please feel free. If you do so, the sooner the better. Remember, like, share the video. Tell a friend for tell a friend. Make yourself if you can go to the channel. No? My people, as me say, jobless. Don't stress over this. Remember, I know one love, enough love. Anything we are doing, we could do it to the best of our ability, my people. Remember now, we have to rise up, rise up, you know. And last but not least, we have to educate, to elevate. So, my people, big up on yourself. I'm out without a doubt.